Meghan Markle hopes she gets pregnant on honeymoon. She and Prince Harry want a big family. Meghan Markle has been dreaming about starting a family with Prince Harry for a long time and since she's been thoroughly enjoying her role as his fiancé, she's ready to become a mother as soon as possible. She has royal baby fever. Meghan Markle, 36, and Prince Harry, 33, are set to walk down the aisle on May 19 and Meghan's already thinking about having a family. The brunette beauty wouldn't mind trying to get pregnant right after their nuptials and even has hopes it will happen on their honeymoon. Both Meghan and Harry are feeling nervous, as most people are before their wedding, but they are both super excited to start their married life together, an insider exclusively told Hollywood Life. Since moving to the UK Meghan's life has been a total whirlwind, and although she's loved every single minute of it, she can't wait for their honeymoon so they can have private time together and get out of the spotlight for a while. Meghan and Harry would both like to have a big family, and they plan to start trying straight away. Meghan would love to fall pregnant on their honeymoon, and has told Harry she wants at least four children. A royal wedding followed by years of Prince Harry and Meghan's children growing up would be so lovely to see and since Meghan always seems to be great when she's around kids, we have a feeling she'd be an awesome mother. In fact, she may be able to practice the role with some very special children on her big day. Prince William and Kate Middleton's two children Prince George, 4, and Princess Charlotte, 3, are reportedly set to be a part of Prince Harry and Meghan's wedding activities. There's no official word on whether or not the newest of the clan, Prince Louis, will join but we can't wait to find out. It won't be long until we see exactly who will show up to celebrate Prince Harry and Meghan's love either. The wedding is set to take place at St. George's Chapel at Windsor Castle on May 19 at noon local time. The ceremony will be able to be viewed live in multiple countries around the world.